Hello friends, I'm Parwiz and this is our 16th video in Android application development. So in the previous video we have learned that how you can uh, open a second activity using a list view when you click an item. So this is from the previous video, uh, you can see we can open uh, our data in the uh, second activity. So in this video I want to show you that how you can implement a custom search view or uh, in your list view. So this is a search view that we are going to implement in our uh, list view. For example, now if I search for something, for example, AV, you can see we don't have this data. But if I search, for example, one, you can see I have this uh, one data. Or if I search, for example, this is, uh, you can see I don't have uh, this data. But if I write, for example, uh, 2, you can see this is our data 2. And if I write uh, 3, you can see that this is our data 3 and you can click on this. So like this, I'm going to show you that how you can uh, filter your list view with a uh, search view. So now let's uh, get started. Okay, so now uh, in our main app, activity.xml, we are going to implement uh, Android so android uh, dot we are going to android dot uh, support dot v7 view search view we are going to implement this and so now we need to android layout uh, width to match parents and android layout uh, height to 15 dp also we need to android uh, we need to add an id for this id i call it uh, search uh, so like this also i'm going to add a default query hint i want to add a hint so search uh, your data so you can see that we have uh, a search view in the xml file now after this uh, we are going to create a new method in here and uh, so right click on a new uh, java class click on java class and i call it uh, search filters whatever you want but i want to call it search filters like this now my this method extends from a uh, filter like this and now we need to uh, implement uh, some methods in here so you need to implement we need to implement these two methods so we have a filter result and this is where we want to publish our filter result okay now we need to create a array list so array list of our data and I call it filtered filtered list like this also I need to create uh, an object of my adapter I call it adapter after this I need to uh, create a constructor so generate constructor mm, like this okay also uh, now in filter result uh, we need to create an object of filter result in the first so filter results uh, I call it a folder result and new filter result. So after that we are going to do some validation because in here we are getting a curse sequence. So now we need to do some validation. Now I want to write if constraints is not null and also uh, the length of uh, constraint is greater than zero. So in this case, we are going to change our constraint to uppercase. So constraint and constraint dot to string dot to uppercase. And after that, uh, and after that, we need to hold our uh, uh, filter data. For this, we need to create a new array list in here, uh, array list of uh, data and I call it filtered data and new array list like this 
now we need to uh, create a for loop so for int i to 0 i is a filtered list dot size so as i is less than filtered list dot size and i plus plus so after doing this now we need to check so if a uh, filtered list uh, dot get i uh, dot get name because we are getting the text according to name of our data and we need to convert that to uppercase dot contains a uh, constraint so if uh, this is the case now we are going to have uh, take our filter data and add that filter list so dot add and we want to add that filtered list dot get and we are going to add i in here okay so uh, after doing uh, this uh, now we need to um, in here we need to exit from the loop and in this section we are going to write a filtered uh, result filtered results dot count and make this to filtered data dot size like this and filtered results dot values and make this to filtered uh, data like this so this is and in the else case we are just going to uh, do um, filtered results dot count and we need to make this to filter uh, list dot size and filter results dot values and make this to filtered list okay and at the end we need to return uh, the filter results in here <coughs> okay so uh, this was our result now we need to uh, do some okay and now we in publish result here uh, we need to uh, so we have created our adapter object so adapter dot uh, data so result uh, filter results dot values uh, filtered results uh, dot sorry we have uh, results in here results dot values and we need to type cast this to the array list so array list like this and now uh, we need to notify uh, notify the adapter change so notify uh, data set change like this so uh, this was our uh, custom uh, this is our uh, search filter uh, class now after this uh, I'm going to open my uh, adapter class and in here okay so now in my adapter class we need to implement filterable so implements filterable and now we need to uh, implement a method so and we need to implement get filter method okay so uh, before this uh, at the top in here uh, we need to uh, create our search filter object so search filter I call it uh, filters like this also I need an array list I call it uh, okay data and I want to call this filtered list so now uh, and also you need to uh, this dot filter list and make this to the data like this so now come down and uh, we need to we need to write our code in the get filter so now I want to check if filter if filters is of if it is null so we need to uh, create the object of our filters so new search filters 
and in here I want to add my filtered list and the uh, adapter we need to give it this like this and we at the end we need to return the filters okay so after this uh, we need to open my main activity uh, let me open main activity Java and here we need to create uh, the object of search view so search view oh I don't need to this oh, I need a v7 library search view so search yeah uh, make sure that uh, you choose this v7 search view and now we need to find this so search view uh, find view by id r dot id dot it is search okay so after this now we need to uh, set on a query text listener in our search view so in here you need to do search view dot uh, set on query text uh, listener new on query text listener okay now we have two methods in here and uh, uh, it's easy now uh, in our this on query text changed you need to just uh, adapter dot get filter dot filter and now you need to add your uh, this uh, text uh, consequent text in here so like this so now this is our complete uh, code let me just run this hopefully it uh, works so now I'm going to open run this in my virtual emulator and I'm waiting for this so guys now this is our list view uh, now uh, I want to search uh, for example I want to search one you can see that I don't have one text in here but if I search second you can see I have a second in here second and for example if you search T uh, for example I I don't have but uh, T H I S is I have uh, first I don't have like this and you can do for example first uh, first and you can see I have uh, for FI I have first and fifth data and if I give R you can see it's first data so like this you can do uh, a search uh, filter in your list view if you have any question please let me know and for the further videos subscribe to my channel and like the videos